chess brings some unique qualities to any kid. It's not about being the champion, but it's about learning self-discipline, just learning something about logic, uh, learning about your own attitude, and at the end of the day, learning about responsibility. Because that's very important, sense of responsibility. That's what is being missed now all over the place. And in chess, you have no one to rely on. I mean, you, you have no backup. It's entirely in your hands. You make a good move, you win. You make a bad move, you lose. So that's a hard lesson you can take from chess. Round one. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Ron, I don't mean to bother you. Identifying your RAM swag is easier than contracting cholera. I'm an epidemiologist. I study disease and pandemics. After the outbreak of my RAMs, I know you need a paramedic. Got Goldberg and Jon Snow backing me up in my corner. I can analyze all your burst guys and recommend a good corner. I'm a true lyricist, giving you a fatal dose. Trying to survive my rhymes is like trying to turn lead into gold. You're smart, I'll agree, but you're not my lead. You teach high school science, sucker, I got a PhD. So come on, scientific method man, let's keep it in perspective. I hate for your strain of arrogance to become socially infected. Inspector F, we need to have a little talk about your statements. If you held the chalk, your waste facilities would have an evacuation. Teaching youth, I plant the intellectual seeds of the next generation. You can't compare such work to boring bacterial progenation. When you rap, it seems like time goes by so slow. Like I'm standing next to a neutron star wrapped around a black hole. When it comes to your flows, you need to reevaluate. They're like the diseases you fight. You've minimized the attack rate. Whether the battles rap, chess, or mathematical, you choke. I bet you got to Google half these lyrics to get these jokes. So I'll keep this next one real simple, real plain. In intelligence, I'm a super brain. You're apart from Krang. Greatest pleasure. Oh, when you break his ego. Did you just reference Ninja Turtles in that last rhyme? Go hide in your half shell and save this valuable time. Because the impact of your lines have a nail second half life. I'm surprised you haven't mutated from playing around with all that slime. Then again, maybe you did, and you're a mutant like the X-Men. But your powers can't be measured by any detector, my friend. Though your students have experienced them time and time again, it's the ability to give lectures that put them to sleep before the end. Your instructions always sound like a teacher from Charlie Brown. But don't let that bum you out. If your students did listen to you, their scores would probably go down. You get your boron, they get their snore on, you wear the blah blah crown. Yep, the data's in, and your verse didn't cause an epidemic. For that to happen, your lines would have to be way less pathetic. You're determined to prevent infections in the populations. Well, mission accomplished, because your rhymes are anything but contagious. The results of my labors are out earning scientific careers. Great think tanks, making banks, doctors, technicians, and engineers. Hearing you just what I've achieved, I can't help but feel disgust. Especially knowing your work's already on a shelf collecting dust. Wicked styles, titration trials, I drop the base. Laboratory tools and fools like you, I put them in their place. Hope you're wearing your goggles, son, cause that last verse jumped up and splashed you in the face. At the championship level, the objective is not only to win, but to demolish your opponent. I uh, enjoy it when I see my opponent, you know, really suffering. Round three. Finish it. Listen here, Lon, you best move off to the next block. This rap is slapping harder than Kasparov slapped a chess block. I understand science in 26 string dimensions. Your one neuron searches for a second to find the mega connection. You can't beat me, teach, not in your wildest dreams. If your students think you're winning, you never taught them what selective bias means. You haven't made a contribution to chemistry, and it's no wonder why. It's real science is getting done, you're busy chasing butterflies. Here, let me see your best study. I'll read it just for fun. Oh, that's right, you never wrote one. Your attack on me as a hater is nothing greater than pure rubbish. But you're busy grading papers, my research papers are getting published. You study diseases, that I can respect, sure. But you should look up halitosis, you can't seem to detect yours. In truth, I'm very proud of you defending your dissertation. You scientifically prove they don't need to include useful information. True, you can't read my work in any peer-reviewed journal, but those things are so dry I've seen more excitement at funerals. When it comes to your research, it might rain eternal, but I've read more groundbreaking work on the walls above urinals. I'm glad we did this rap together, it's certainly been fun, but I knew you'd have to lose before we'd even begun. See, my skills are like Star Trek II, The Wrath of Khan, where it's yours or just Star Wars, Episode 1. Ha 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 